Okay, this is not meat, this is a red pepper, FYI. <laughs> Some rare meat. Good morning, you guys. We are still under quarantine and we are going to be doing the most realistic fridge dump meal that ever existed. I am taking all of the leftovers from my fridge and I am chopping them up. So this is a red pepper, not a piece of meat, Olivia. <laughs> tell me when you're ready. I'll tell you when I'm good and ready. And you don't you ever try to me that way, Jen. I'm good and ready. Okay, you do Tell your mother I'm good and ready. <laughs> I'll get dinner ready when I'm good and ready. Okay! Mother, I'm, I'm ready to chop my food, be quiet! Don't you ever talk to me like that again. <laughs> Toots, you know I told you how Ray wanted to talk to you. You just can't talk to me. <laughs> <laughs> you laugh like it's true. Come on, cut, cut it out. Okay, um, what the heck was I even gonna say? Danny Tanner? No! no. I don't know how, I don't know why, but when you chop your veggies really, really small, they taste better, the kids are more willing to eat them because, well, they can't pick them out as easy. Fine chop, fine chop, fine chop. Did all of you just check your phone? Nope, that was mine. Sorry, everyone at home. You guys, someone was like, I cringe so hard at Bonnie's knife skills. Well, let me tell you, folks, I never claimed to be. Anything other than just making the food videos, I'm just giving you food recipe ideas. I'm not a food chopper professionally. Yeah. Yeah, go to the Tasty channel. No, don't, stay here. <laughs> well, when our blog's done, you can go there. Say, Bonnie sent me. Actually, go to Josh, Josh Wiseman's. That's who you want to go to. Yeah. Or Sam the Cooking Guy, or any of them. Say, Bonnie sent you. It's good. They'll know. They'll know what that means. <laughs> And they just like came looking this way. When has anybody ever been sick from like dirty greens? Did you hear the kids? Like what is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? I have a few chives left over from a recipe that I used earlier this week. Um, these don't look incredibly awesome, but there's only a few of them. So we're just gonna chop them up and throw them in. They smell good. I mean, aren't chives normally a little bit bigger? Got some leftover cabbage that I don't want to go to waste. I'm just going to slice and dice. Cut of Tuck in your pants. Let's go. Come on. I swear, if you just showed my face again, you are gonna get it. I didn't show your face. Yes, you did. I did not. Nice face. Remember who used to say that? Who? Peyton Palmer. Oh! oh I say nice that. face. Somehow my spinach goes bad before I get a chance to use it. So we are chopping up all of the spinach and we are going to throw it in the bowl as well. Oh, don't wipe it on your robe. <laughs> robe. I told you it was the ultimate fridge clean out. We have some cottage cheese that I want to get rid of. I saw someone making eggs with cottage cheese because it makes them fluffy, adds more protein, and they said it makes them taste really good. Garlic, always garlic. Am I gonna just turn it over and do it? Yeah, go for it. We don't, I don't need a okay. cool shot of the press. Yes, you do. It's not that cool. Yes, it is. I like to pre-peel all my garlic and stick it in a container because I use it so much, but it also gives the kids something to do during the week, like when I'm cooking. It's a good way to have them help. Why do we always have your undivided attention when we're cooking? 
dog. This looks like a beautiful salad in here. I cannot wait for this to cook up. If you have never tried um, cabbage in your eggs, you should try it. It's really good. On medium heat, we're just going to cook it up. We put salt and pepper in there, put a little butter in the pan beforehand. Once the egg is a little firm, not sinking to the bottom, we put the heat to low and put the lid on. Meanwhile, while the eggs are cooking, <laughs> You think she know? Did she know which one? Okay, she chose the red. She chose the red. Okay, she chose that one. Do it again and see if she'll pause. Okay, I have to put it under a white one so then one should know. Or wait, I wonder if she will. Let's see. Okay. Okay. No, she has no idea. Okay. Oh. <laughs> she got it. We're just stirring this every now and again. Um, this pan and lid though, it is so good. I will link it in the description for you guys. This is just for Joel and I, but I'm gonna chop up the very last of the jala pickled jalapenos. These are mild, they're not that hot. They're so flavorful and delicious. I'm gonna top the eggs with sour cream. Topping Joel's with a little sriracha. Thank you guys so much for watching our fridge dump dinner ideas. Literally, no lie, these are the best eggs I have ever eaten. And blood oranges. Are so good. Joel, this is so good. Pretty tasty. Going to be a, don't put it on me, are you kidding me? Oh. I look so hideous. Ready? I just got out of <laughs> We'll keep it on the pretty red pepper. Okay. I just felt water. It could have been a splash from this. Oh, that. <laughs> scared you? Yeah. Yeah. It was a splash from About this. About to grab my pants. I know, something you will never know. Okay, I hope these are still good. See, if you would have been recording, you could have caught all that, Joel. Sunday morning, rain is falling. Remember how much we used to love that song? I still do. Okay, go. Oh, sorry, hold on. Oh. I, I think I was gonna say something. Okay, um, say something. <laughs> say something, I'm getting up on you. I'm getting up on this shot, let's go. Okay, go. Um, I gotta think of what I was gonna say. Heavens to Betsy. Ooh, that sounded weird. <laughs> we put, shh, shh, Lincoln, shh. Okay, quiet, everyone. Quiet! Okay, quiet! Turn the TV down! Turn the TV down.